The G-Town soul swales are located in the heart of Glasgow. So anybody can plant a seed, pull a weed, take what they need, and eat for free. It's a permaculture swale system, if I can get that out properly. So it, uh, we, we dug trenches in the ground and flipped it up in order to allow water to permeate the, the mounds so that there's no water source. Latoya Drake, the Barron County Family and Consumer Sciences Extension Agent, was working with the garden and the local farmer's market before she became an extension agent. This is um, darker. So then she met Andrea Stiff, Barron County's horticulture extension agent, and the two teamed up. And then once she became an extension agent, we full on tried to work together and partner and, and make this more of a community effort and get everybody involved and get the extension office involved as well. But uh, then there are also some like little plants. Youth from local churches were involved this day from the Love Loud organization, shoveling and loading soil into a wheelbarrow for dumping on the swale mounds and then putting vegetable plants in the soil. There were also ripe blueberries to be picked before the birds got them and then washed to be shared. Sister and little brother Grace and Paul Lowe have been volunteering at the garden for some time because they want to help others. It's a really great idea. Uh, Glasgow has a large population of people who are food, food insecure and this is a good way for them to be able to get healthy foods for cheap because we know people who are food insecure tend to buy uh, not healthy food because it's cheaper. It's really fun to dig in the dirt mm -hmm. and then you also have to work a little and it's fun to help people in need. This old school building here in Glasgow is now the Ralph Bunch Community Center and also is a soup kitchen. And in back is where the kids are working in the garden. This garden sits on a historical building in Glasgow, Kentucky. It's the Ralph Bunch Center, uh, which was a, a segregated school at one time that turned into a preschool center and is now a soup kitchen. So we really are excited to have a place that has food for everybody. Latoya Drake says she's excited about being an extension agent so she can show people in need how to use the food from the garden and the abundance of fresh produce that is plentiful in the farming community of Glasgow. From the University of Kentucky College of Agriculture, Food and Environment, I'm Jeff Franklin reporting.